This question belongs to digital logic subject and was asked in GATE CSC 2023. So the question states, the output of a two input multiplexer is connected back to one of its input as shown in the figure. Match the following equivalence of this circuit to one of the following options. D flip flop, D latch, half header or D multiplexer. See here, see here. here we have the select line and two inputs 0 and 1. Let us name this as I0 and I1. So I0 is equal to the output which is Q. So I0 is equal to Q and I1 equals to the input. Let us name this as X. So I1 equals to X. So what is the table for a multiplexer? So if we have a select line, then the output Q. If the select line is 0, then we are getting I0 as output. If the select line is 1, then we are getting I1 in the output. So Q plus, which is the next state, can be written as S complement I0 plus S I1. Now let us see the conditions when S equals to 0. When S equals to 0, then Q plus equals to 0 complement I0 plus 0 into I1. 0 complement is 1, 1 into I0 plus 0. So it equals to I0. And what is I0 equals to? I0 is equals to Q, which is the previous output. Thus, this is the memory state. Memory state means previous output is retained. Now what happens for S equals to 1? There Q plus equals to 1 complement I0 plus 1 into I1. So 1 complement equals to 0 into I0 plus I1. So Q, Q plus equals to our X. Q plus equals to I1 which equals to X. So here we have got Q plus equals to X which means output equals to the input. As here you can see that either we can have a D flip flop or a D latch. Or so a D latch is level triggered and D flip flop is an edge triggered. Here you can see that on S equals to 0 and S equals to 1, this S is basically acting as a clock. This S is basically acting as a clock. And on 0 to 1, it's changing the output. Thus, it is level triggered. And on 0, it is having a memory state. Thus, answer is D latch, option B.